So this truck has been our home for uh, the last few days and it's roomy, it's really, really roomy. So we, um, the other night we slept here and there's enough room for Sarah to just crawl around everywhere in it. Yeah. Which is perfect. It's like a small little cabin for me. Yeah, it's a small cabin for you. <laughs> Are you getting ready? Mm-hmm. my shit up. <laughs> Perfect. So we're getting ready to get down and get some juice, then hand over to the bug crowd headquarter for fun times. Have you been having a good time? I've been having a really good time. It's been, um, so far, it's been really, 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 really nice. So I just had this Vietnamese lunch with Phil and Chloe and uh, now we're going to head over to the bug crowd hackers walk thing. Yep, we're going to go walk and hack the streets. <laughs> so we got, we got in a car and we're heading over to meet up with the other guys that are preparing to go for the walk. And because we're getting a little bit of a tour of San Francisco, it's the challenge. Uh, it's like being born again. <laughs> Are you excited about today? Oh, I've been waiting for this for a long time. Cool. Yeah, you ready to learn some more about SF? I would love to learn more. So this was actually, before it was a bank, probably the only thing that's more American than money. A weird semi-religious cult. This was the original home of the Masons on the West Coast. You can see their signs on here because Masons don't like to advertise who they are. So Kevin, I'm, I'm, I'm really impressed by the skills that you have when you're really explaining. Because Kevin's been explaining to us like everything when it comes to like the history of the city and everything. How, how do you know so much about it? Uh, so when I actually came here, I went to a school called Academy of Art University. It's a fantastic place. Okay. It really let me explore some passions. Uh, and they do this thing where you can get cheaper tuition if you help out with the school. Okay. I didn't really want to run the board at like basketball games. I didn't want to do anything. So I had a really cool philosophy teacher say, hey, we actually do walking tours for new students in their first week. Yeah. We think he'd be great at it. So he actually bet on me, taught me everything I need to learn. And here we are, able to share the knowledge with more and more generations. <laughs> And, and, and for me, as um, like a guest in this town, understanding what's you know the basic of it, like you said, first time people even came here, they more or less burned their ships and yeah. built the city on top of whatever that was. Yeah. Out of the wreckage comes the best things, right? Like if you're not willing to go 100% into an idea, why even do it? Like there should be no way to go back home. This is your future. This is what you want. <laughs> Burn your ship, baby. Come live here. <laughs> Always past the event horizon. So today is game day and I'm gonna head over to the area or the location where Bug Bash is being held. Pretty sweet swag we got this time. And um, so first I'm gonna get a green juice and some coffee and then it's all about hacking. So we got everything packed, we're ready to go. So yesterday was a pretty cool day. We got the um, possibility to get shown around the town by Kevin. He used to be a tour guide before, so it was really impressive to get to see some certain parts of the city and understand the basics on that this city has been built upon. It was also really cool to spend some time over at the Bug Crowd headquarters. I haven't been there before, and just being there in the presence of all the engineers and hanging out there and meeting people that you only seen on hangout calls or met in the Slack channel is a really cool thing, and I feel very privileged to be able to do that. So the bag ba bug bash is in full on set. Everybody's just hacking away. Uh, Eric, today's new is in the lead, which is pretty amazing. And uh, and everybody seems to have like a really, really good time. Food's been great, venue's great. And it's such a privilege to be able to really, you know, get to discuss things with the team here to get deeper in when you find the box. So it's really, really cool. How's it going, boys? Good. Yeah. 
It's pretty nice that bugs are flowing in, right? Yeah, dude. These guys are too excited. They are too excited. Hi, Inti. You found the best room. You found the best room again. I know, nobody found it. Yep, super secret, I but... Nobody. It's it's in the middle of, of everything and nobody noticed. I don't know why, but I got it. It's kind of nice. I'm still waiting for the plumber. I have no water yet. Does the water run in here? Not yet, not yet. Yeah. I just called a plumber. <laughs> um, but I all, already have uh, electricity. I had to plug it in myself in the walls. Yeah. And you got a printer. Yeah, and also a fridge. So for a sec, you got an beer in there? Maybe, maybe this is a fridge. Yeah, this is a fridge, I think. Can you? Oh. No, it's, no, it's it, oh, okay, it's one of those. <laughs> so it's four or five minutes left. Yeah. 45 minutes left. How's it gone? Well, I um, actually I quit for today. Uh, I, I'm really happy with what I found and I, now I'm uh, making uh, my reports as pretty as possible. Actually, turn around my screen because it can be on camera. But am I famous yet? <laughs> you, you, you're famous. Uh, that's Inti for you. Wherever, you know, he's always the constant, most epic troller out there. And, and but then again, he's also one of the best in the game. Don't underestimate, uh, underestimate his smart and good boyish looks for experience. <laughs> so close, man. Yeah, so yeah, you guys just went up. Yeah, yeah. We're switching between the first, second, and third. Yep. Recently. How many bugs do you report? 60, 70. 60 or 70 bugs? I think we have 50 something. 50, yeah, 50 something triage. We're probably like 60, 70 reports total. Wow, that's so cool. You guys did great. Sick. So this is a small parking like van, like a really code. small so one. Mm -hmm. Is it in this show and tell? Yeah, yeah, yeah it's, it's a show and tell, dude. Cool. Oh, no, if, no if, camera. If joined Inti for his private show and tell. Can I get a little bit of feedback what what you felt seeing that? It's like when you're, you're not allowed to talk about know, anything. Yeah yeah you know like when you find a a P5 yeah. and another one and another one it's like you chain bugs and eventually you'll reach cosmic brain level yeah. seven. And Inti was the first human in the hacker history in the digital era to ever to ever reach like level seven. That's it. I, I've been on level, cosmic level. I, I've, I've been on fucking level six. I know. I, 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 I've, I've seen you, you do there. it. I've yeah, seen you do it. I've not seen you level do it. seven. What Inti just did was mind blowing. Of course, it's under extreme NDA, and we had to hide in this tiny little box to see it. But it was mind blowing, and. Damn, Inti, you're great. Reese just won the coolest MVP award ever. It's the hammer. It's a bug slayer hammer, kind of, in a way. Yeah, it's so, pretty hefty. Check that could out. You, could you spill some tea about what kind of bugs you found? Did, did you find any... Uh, apparently, we can't talk about anything that has to do with this, but yeah. in theory, could you say that it was a... Good or a bad bug? Uh, good for me, bad for them, that's for sure. Exactly. Yeah. Uh, look, it was tough though, they, they made me dig for it. So, yeah, yeah these, were, these were things that you really had to sort of piece together and get bits of information here and there. Yeah? Yeah. And, um, and how much did, time did you actually spend on it? It was like you went, woke up, touched on it, there was, or. Yeah, I, I've been going like the whole time here. Like, I'd say three hours sleep a night. Yeah. That's pretty rough. Yeah. My old bones can't handle that. Much. That's how it is. You you find the target, you fall in love with it, and you dig deep on it, and you end up doing things like that. Yeah. It's amazing. Awesome. Go hacking. <laughs>